Hi, I'm Sonia from Sustain My Craft Habit, and we're here in my living room. The small behind me is huge, and I've always struggled with knowing what to put on it. It's pretty much the first room you see, and the first thing you see when you walk into the house. So when Enjoy the Wood agreed to partner with us and send me one of their handcrafted 3D world maps, I was so excited and really couldn't wait for it to arrive. Welcome back to our channel. Like many people, our family travel plans this past summer pretty much went out the window. We had a family dream vacation planned for Ireland and with the stay booked and all of the itinerary planned out, we had to put a hold on it. It just happened that around the time we were supposed to be on our family vacation, we discovered this really cool company called Enjoy the Wood. The company was founded in 2015 by a small Ukrainian family, and since then they've grown their team and their business and are creating unique and beautiful handcrafted products for people all over the world. But it was their patented signature 3D world map Maps that really struck a chord and wowed me as soon as I saw it. The maps are completely handmade out of high quality birch plywood. As woodworkers ourselves, we really appreciate the intricacy and uniqueness of each of these pieces. So today we're super excited to share this product with you and actually unbox it for the very first time. And we'll also be installing it here in my living room on this big giant wall. Okay, so let's get started. So here's the package, it came in really good shape. So I'm going to go ahead and open it. Enjoy the wood. It ships free worldwide. So we're in Canada and it came all the way from the Ukraine. Might need another set of hands. <laughs> nope, I got it out. Oh my goodness, how cute is this? packaging. So even the packaging is really thoughtful. It makes for a really, really great gift giving idea. Something that comes just like this would be perfect. Oh, look at these. So each kit has an option to get push pins and these are the world flags like all over the world. How cool is this? Or there's another option for metal airplane push pins as well. Oh, Canada. So neat. Oh my goodness. You can keep track of everywhere you've been in the world. They even have all of the states for the US and the provinces for Canada and Australia. So cool. I can't believe how much detail goes into this. Okay, so let's see what else is in here. Got this brochure. Let's see, you open it up. Got, looks like a coupon code for next purchase. What's this? Some stickers, so oh, that's cute. There, let's see what else. Oh, this is the warranty. So there is a lifetime warranty with every purchase. And there's the family that founded the business. Okay, so those would be the instructions on how to put it up on the wall. So we'll have to read that. <laughs> so these maps come in different sizes and different finishes. And this is the multi-layered in a dark walnut finish, but they're, they also come in colored options as well as other wood stain options like oak finish, a terra finish, and a multicolor finish as well as this dark walnut color. And then they, like I said, there's four different sizes. I chose the large for my wall, but there is a medium size, a large, an extra large, and double extra large depending on what you need for your Wall. Let's see. So here are the oceans. There's so much detail. Oh my goodness. Oh. Let's keep finding more and more. Look at this. Holy. Look at how small this little map is. Turks and Caicos and Barbados. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> oh, how perfect. Enjoy the wood. Does anybody else feel like traveling? Newfoundland, one of my must-go-see places. What about you? Let me know, leave a comment down below. Where is your next travel destination, if you could choose? So this is the three, the multi-layer. You see how there's different levels. 
So each piece is hand stained and hand sanded, everything all handcrafted. How beautiful. I cannot wait to get this on the wall. So how's your world geography? Um, not as good as it should be. <laughs> I need the kids to help me out. You like puzzles, Jane. It's more fun okay. just watching you do it. Yeah, watch watch me do struggle. It. Okay. So the instructions say to place it on the floor in the way that it's gonna be going up on the wall. So I'm working on that. But then what you do is place, so I have a bunch of the little ones too, but you place this double-sided adhesive on the back of each of the pieces and that's what holds it up on the wall. So the assembly does take some time, so you um, don't expect to be done in, in a matter of minutes. It is like a puzzle, so there is some enjoyment <laughs> with it. I have my coffee here and hoping Jane will help. <laughs> <laughs> or just yeah, watch me do that. You, you like my coffee. <laughs> so that's the plan. So I think it takes about an hour. So make sure you have that bit of window to assemble it. Is that stuff removable? That double-sided tape? Yes, it is. From what I read, it's removable. You just need to use a hair dryer and get um, heat in between the wall and the tape, and it can be um, detached. But you'll have to replace it with other double-sided tape. Yes, I have. The map of the world in front of me. So now I'm going to put the double-sided tape on the back side of each of the pieces and there's a guide here basically to say like where to place. It's like on the along the outer edges, a few of them. What's up? So then I'll move on to the other parts. Next up is putting the map on the wall. I just wipe down the wall, just you have to make sure it's not dusty or dirty or anything like that. And now I need to measure where the map is gonna actually go. Because I have the size large map, that's 59 inches wide and 35 inches high. So I'm just gonna mark that, center it over my couch. So I've marked the center point, which is here. And then I'm just going to mark on either side and measure down from the ceiling so that the, the map is level. Okay, so these are the templates to get started. One is going to go on that corner and then number two is going to go on that corner and then I'm just going to work my way in. One more thing to mention is that this company, Enjoy the Wood, is family run and committed to customer service. So if there's anything at all that you want to change about the map, you all you need to do is contact the team ahead of time as you're ordering and discuss customization. Okay, so now I'm ready. I've got my templates on the wall and I'm gonna start with Alaska. Do you have the other piece? There you go. Thanks. <laughs> well, Thanks help. for here. Okay, so take off the back side of the double sided tape. It takes a bit of time. Yeah, it's kind of a pain. Okay, done. What's next? Work in. What are you handing me? <laughs> Greenland? Something in the middle? <laughs> You're Canada! The best place. We're right here. <laughs> With all of the <laughs> the backing still on there, thanks. I'm all alone here. Okay, so I've laid out all the pieces here and I've taken the backing off all the tape to make it, this part a little bit faster. So the removal of the, the tape backing took a bit of time. I think if I was to do it again, I would cut the strips and peel the backing as I'm cutting the strips and placing them on the, the reverse side. That would probably be faster. But now it's done, so I'm just gonna continue with the map. Some of the things that I wanted to mention that are hard to show in the video, but really worth um, talking about are the beauty and the three-dimensional layered effect. It shows a lot of interest. Each of the cutouts, even the smallest of islands, has so much detail um, that it's really beautiful and there's so much to look at. So those are the main ones. Now I think I'm gonna put the all the little islands before I put Australia and Greenland down. Okay, so that's it. Here's the map 
on my wall, my living room wall, and I think it looks amazing. It's beautiful, it's even better than I was expecting it to look. And the amount of detail and quality is, uh, is just beautiful. So it did take a bit of time to put together and assemble it on the wall, but luckily I had my sister Jane with me to help. And actually it was a lot of fun, I have to say, and I actually also did learn <laughs> Um, some things about geography. <laughs> me too. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So it was very, the instructions are very detailed and to fo easy to follow along. A few places we had to search up where they belong, but it was a fun lesson along the way. Because I also ordered the push pins, because the country flags on them, I can go along and stick them into the places that I've been in the world. So I have a few in my hands and this is going to be fun. So although traveling is on hold for the time being, having this map is making me feel really grateful for the places that I did have a chance to go see and also bringing about quite a few memories of places I've been. I'm also really glad that the map is well fixed to the wall because that means that Jane, my sister, it. <laughs> my sister cannot come and grab it and take it to her home. Be sure to check out enjoythewood.com for more information. And for any DIYs and nature-inspired craft ideas, head over to our blog, sustainmycrafthabit.com. Thank you so much for watching. Bye! Bon voyage! C'est la tempête! Adios! <laughs>